Ramba ke jalla o kondat ke sangma ula pli ek stem fusion workshop bat ka jipun inam ki khana pule bala penlong da connector ha state convention center shillong man taka singi ka jing thumu jong ka ni ka program ka long man pen i ki sap ki phong ka jing hi ka ek khlo ki but jing te ban pen bet ki jing e ha ki jing pule bat ka men sim jong ka jing a khun ha bakran ha ka ni ka singi umentri rangba ula ong ba ki khna na do ka class Eight hundred class ten ki long ki kerdan ki bakong san e ban pin wandur ya ka boar jing tip ka jong ki. Ula ban rab ru da ka ba pin pao ya ka jing shim kia jong ka sor ka da ka ba ai jing ka shan. Bat bai ting ka ha kum ki ni program na ban pin kia ya ka jing pro aja bing ka ni kina kuli ka jala. For us, before maths and science, it was a class for us. It was actually a boring class because for us, uh, before maths and science was like, for us, it was a free period. We could sleep, have fun and all. But now we can see what is there more to learn in maths and science. We can see that it's a lot more than we think. Now we'll, we see that all experiments that we have done has, maybe we'll reach new heights in the future. So it's kind of helped you a lot. Yes, it has helped us a lot. So what would be your advice to your fellow friends? To my fellow friends would be is that to never give up and sure you can focus on other things but academics also is not a joke. Academics you can achieve a lot of things mostly because in the world right now buildings, architecture, everything goes with maths and science so it's really important in life. We have this AI house and this wire remote control car. So this AI house work by voice commands. It accepts uh, the command that you have insert on it. Any command that you insert only that you accept and no, uh, nothing else. It uh, it send high frequent uh, into high uh, signal high and low. High means uh, on, uh, low means off. So example ni hao house light on house light on house light off uh, that is so it works on voice command yeah okay which school are you from uh, just give us your basic, basic introduction where you... uh, my name is Rikista Karbani I'm from HLS Memorial High School school from uh, North Shiyang Okay. okay, can you tell us, uh, you know, who helped you to make this? Uh, I make by myself. I make by myself. Only the resources is provided. Okay. Tell us a little bit about this STEM. How it help? How it help you? It helped me uh, by to how in to help me in in improving my creativity. Uh, I have uh, talent in this uh, creativity in making things, other things, but uh, I have a limited resource to make. So uh, this uh, STEM lab helped me in that to have some resources, help me in anything, uh, provide me internet for that and to make, help me to learn many things. For a large number of students, to our youngsters, especially in rural areas, and uh, even so in uh, you know big urban areas also but less but more in in rural areas i would say and uh, what the effort of nectar smart village movement and the government at large where the center of state is to be able to find a way to be able to make science, mathematics, engineering, technology, all of this fun, interesting, something that you would actually be curious about, to create that curiosity in the kids, which is not there today. And uh, of course, as I said, it's not something that we'll be able to just simply solve in a matter of you know, a year or two years. It's a process. I was just having a word with the uh, principal secretary 
And he was mentioning me that I had mentioned in my speech in, on 15th August that we need to be patient as a state and as a country and as citizens. Change happens, but change takes time. You can't expect changes to take place overnight. And therefore, this is a step towards improving the overall scenario and the interest and the curiosity that the children should have, the fun part element of what people should, students should feel when they think about technology, about science and about mathematics.